Okay, Lauren, let's do the American dining style. Let's pick up our utensils, please. Index fingers in place. Make sure the handle is in your palm. Make sure your index finger is at the top of the utensil, the top of the knife, the very top. Yes, and it stops at the neck. Now let's pretend we're cutting, let's say, chicken breast. And you hold down the chicken breast with the fork and we are cutting. Do we saw the food? Use your words. No. Okay. You're finished cutting that piece. Place your knife at the top. What is interesting about the positioning of the knife? The, the part where, that you cut it with, it has to face me. Yes, yeah, so the cutting side of the knife faces you. Switch the fork to your right hand, which is your dominant hand. You're holding it like a pencil, and you're enjoying. What did you do with that other hand you're not using? We're going to put it in your idle hand inside of your lap. Put it in your lap. Okay, good. Okay. Now it's time to cut again. You switch the fork back to your right hand. Hand Handle in the palm. Index finger at the top. Retrieve that knife. Index finger at the top. And we are cutting again. Good. We are finished cutting that piece. Place the knife at the top. Switch the fork to your dominant hand and enjoy that portion. Wonderful. Now, pretend you'd like to, well, you'd like to pause because you want to take a drink. Place your fork in the five o'clock position. And before you take that drink, are you going to dab your mouth just in case there's some food on the corners of your mouth? Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> And now you'd like to take a drink holding the glassware. On the stem. And looking into the glass as you drink to pay attention to the flow of the beverage. And you're all set. Now it's time to cut the final piece. Pick up your fork with your right hand, hand it to your left hand, why do you pick up the fork with your right hand? Because it's closer to it and you don't want to reach over your food. Right, you don't want to cross your body. Great. All right, make sure that index finger is in place and the handle is in your palm. Retrieve that knife, index finger in place, and we're cutting. Remember, we don't saw. Cut the final piece. You're finished cutting that piece. Beautiful. Now you are finished with that course. Place the fork in at 5 o'clock, and the knife accompanies the fork. Excellent job! Hey, hey, hey! Give yourself a hand. Good job! <laughs>